what you did for my Ralphie. Thank you. I would give you gold if I had it, but all I have is this old apple. Well, I could give you my boy. He's my dear sweet baby, but he sure eats a lot. I know it sounds heartless, Rangers, but I can't feed him in this godforsaken place. With the train not running, nobody around here is making a living. Taking Ralphie would be a kindness to me and him. And he's awfully handy with a slingshot. He could help you. What do you say? Will you take my Ralphie and make a ranger out of him? Oh, thank you, rangers. You've saved both of us. Now come along, Ralphie. These nice rangers are your new parents. You have to go with them now. Gee, that's great. This place is nice and all, but I'd rather be out having adventures with you. Thank you for saving my Ralphie. I'm sure he'll make a wonderful ranger. Echo One, this is Ranger. Echo One, congratulations, Echo One. You've done well. Hey, Rangers. I'm really sorry, but I've got to talk to my friend Jesse over there. If you don't want to wait, I'll understand. I'll just meet you back at Ranger Citadel. Sorry, Ralphie. It was such a bad idea for us to meet at the lake. It's so... gross. Forget it. We'll find some other place to be alone. I'm just glad you're okay. If the Rangers hadn't showed up, I would have had to have asked your tribe for help. No way! If they catch you in our camp, they'll report you to Master Kekaba. I'm just so tired of all this fighting. Why don't we just leave this stupid place for good? But how? We wouldn't last a day on foot. I, but I Jesse, I, I gotta go home. Another Topekan could come by at any minute and I'd be shit out of luck. See you tomorrow, Ralphie. Jesse's right. We can't stay here and be together. If I can save up some scrap working with you guys, maybe I can get her out of here. Can I come with you again? All right, I'm ready to get out of here. <laughs>